Infiniti's built their brand on sporty sedans, but the Q50 steps away from that. The steering is really pretty boring. There's not a lot of feedback on center, and it doesn't give you much confidence when you're driving quickly. The optional direct adaptive steering is fully steer by wire. There's no mechanical connection. This gives it very little feedback. There's just one transmission, a seven speed automatic. Shifts are smooth and quick. Unfortunately, you can't get a manual transmission anymore. Inside, the Q50 is more spacious than the average compact upscale sports sedan. If you don't like the aluminum trim, you can get wood instead. Infinity's in-touch control system uses two big touchscreens. This is good and bad. Conventional buttons control many functions, and most on-screen buttons and fonts are good sized. Our Q50 premium all-wheel drive stickered for $44,855, including navigation and leather heated seats. Be careful though, because option packages can quickly drive the price up to $50,000.